What's going on you guys, Indigenous Rookie Cards, aka Name, coming at you with another video for YouTube. I hope you're all doing well on this Friday night. I'm here to open up a couple packages for you I got in the mail right here. Uh, I'm going to show you a couple things as well. Uh, a little bit of this is going to be a continuation of a video that I made a couple weeks ago, just because I got more cards to add to that uh, particular topic. But anyway, um, before I get into that, uh, I'm hoping you're all going on to Craft Hockeyville onto the Craft Hockeyville website and you're voting for El Sebeck Doug, uh, First Nation. Uh, please vote for them for their new arena. Uh, I think it would be a great opportunity for the community. Please watch their video on the Craft Hockeyville Instagram. Um, very, very sad situation with their arena burning down recently. And, you know, in a lot of the First Nation communities, the, the arena is the heart of the community. That's where a lot of people go from you know, being uh, a young, young kid all the way to being an old timer hockey player, that's where everyone hangs out. That's where everyone sees each other. A lot of social aspect to that. A lot of uh, mental health is uh, is focused while you're on a, while you're at the arena, and uh, uh, the arenas are so important for the community. So if you get the chance, please go vote for them. Uh, I, I did a few times today. Hopefully you did already. But anyway, uh, we'll just get on to uh, my mail here and a few of the cards. Before I get my get to my mail, I have a few things to show you here. So this, um, if you remember the last video, I got this card. This is the uh, Upper Deck MVP Brandon Nolan Rookie Gold Scripts out of 100. So receiving this, um, this completed my rainbow for the Upper Deck MVP. Um, this is a card I've been looking for for a while, so oddly enough, it was in the package that was sent to me um, earlier this week. So I just wanted to show you those three cards together. So these are the three cards. Um, this is the regular version. This was the one that was sent to me from Brandon Nolan. He autographed it for me. Uh, this is the one that was sent to me earlier this week uh, in the rack, Random Act of Kindness package and then I got this uh, in June 2020 this is the this is the superscript out of 25 just a really sweet card you can see the foil shining on it really good looking card uh, this one this one's pretty sweet too not as much shine as the superscript out of 25 but nonetheless a beautiful looking card all three of these together they look awesome um, yeah it feels good to finish a rainbow get that out of the way and add that to my three nolans collection got my three nolan shirt on once again i love this shirt um if you get a chance go on their uh go on their instagram they got all their their goods posted on there i'm not sure if they have their website up and running yet but um they have a lot of good uh a lot of good clothing hats uh all that kind of stuff available uh, this package right here, this is a, pack, a card I picked up off Instagram from um, your Emco Brothers. Uh, I think I got this, I picked this up about a week ago. This package is really glued together. Um, so what's in here is, this is a uh, 20, I think it's a 2020-21 Opeachy. Um, Michael McNiven rookie card. So if you don't, if you're not aware, Michael McNiven is is a Métis hockey player, um, and he did he did dress for, I think at least one game this year. He did back up. So when as a goalie, if you do back up for a game, uh, you're automatically qualifying for uh, a hockey card. So he hasn't officially played any games yet, but this is the Michael McNiven rookie card. This is the OPG uh, update set. This one is out of Upper Deck. And this was pulled by uh, the Yuremko Brothers uh, Instagrammers, I guess. And, um, you know, they, they reached out to me. They said they had it available. I had no idea he had a card. I, got, um, I heard he got called up, but I didn't even know that he, he dressed for the game and was backing up. And... Lo and behold, he has a he has a rookie card now, so that's going in my collection. Hopefully, he will get into a game this year. He's playing in uh, at the AHL right now and uh, doing pretty well down there, from um, what I hear. Anyway, thanks a lot, Hayden. 
appreciate that card. Um, if you don't know, Hayden is a former uh, Junior A hockey player. Um, if you're unfamiliar with the Junior Leagues in Canada, Junior A is a very, very high level of Junior Hockey. It's a step below Major Junior, but um, those guys can play. Like, if you ever go to a Junior A game, the, just the speed, the skill of those games is unbelievable. And uh, Hayden was actually a, a teammate of uh, Brady Keeper for uh, a short time. So, uh, really cool that he's a former hockey player and he's collecting hockey cards and you know, he, he um, obviously he's um, recognized my collection, which is pretty awesome. And I appreciate him reaching out to me to uh, offer this card to me. Um, so thank you once again, Hayden. Um, this next package, this came, uh, this came from the US. Um, actually, uh, this kind of went through a middleman and then came to me. So this card um, I seen on, on eBay, uh, probably about a month ago and it was on ebay.com and eBay a lot of sellers on ebay.com do not ship to Canada um, I have an eBay app and it just defaults to all the Canadian listings just because so I was just I was on using my web browser and I went on ebay.com and I was looking up some uh, Jonathan Chichu cards and uh, this card came up and it's actually a card that I need for my rainbow, so I'm very excited to open it, if I can ever get this open. But um, anyway, what I did was I messaged one of my buddies from the U.S., uh, Kevin Shaw, if you're, un if you're unfamiliar with his page. Um, he has a couple Instagram pages. He has the uh, Herbie's Revenge. He has Untaped Top Loader. Actually, has three. And then he has Rink Rack Collectibles, which is his um his collectible store on instagram so if you get a chance check that out rink rack collectibles they got a lot of cool um items available for sale sale a lot of throwback clothing uh you gotta check it out it's really sweet but anyway kevin is a really really good dude and uh you know what that's a guy i appreciate in the hobby we get each other we understand where we're coming from um you know he collects a, a lot of uh the minority hockey players too so um indigenous players are a part of his collection actually so um i really appreciate him doing this for me for um being so willing to so he 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 essentially he bid on the card he 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 won it he said i asked him to send the best offer of eight dollars for this card it was listed for 10 i think us and what I did was I asked them to uh, send an offer of eight dollars. The um, seller accepted, and uh, card got sent to Kevin. I sent them the money. I paid for the shipping, and he sent it my way. And uh, what a guy! He sent me, uh, he sent me some stickers from his store, Rink Rat Collectibles. So shout out to you, Kevin. Uh, check out his page on Instagram, Rink, Rink Rat Collectibles. So thanks a lot for the stickers. I appreciate that a lot. And now onto the card. So this card here, oh man, this is a super sweet card. Uh, this is the, let me put it in here upside down, and, which is different, but okay. Uh, so this card here, this is the 1998 Bowman CHL set that I'm working on for Jonathan Chicho. And this is number 142. And this is the 50th anniversary parallel uh, for the Chrome version. So if you look down the side, you can see the 50th, 50th uh, anniversary there. Um, yeah, it says Bowman 50th anniversary. And then on the back, it's stamped out of 50. So this is the final card I need for the rainbow for number 142. So this is a huge card for me because I've been working on this rainbow for so long. And as I mentioned in the previous video, there's not a lot of these cards out there. It's not like people are busting open boxes of Bowman CH, 1998 Bowman CHL these days. So, you know, a lot of these are hiding in people's collections. Um, they might not even know they have it. Um, but now my rainbow is complete. So what I wanna show you is my complete rainbow. So, so 
Okay, so here we go. So we have the Bowman CHL regular version, the Bowman Chrome version, the Bowman Chrome refractor. Look at that beautiful shine on that refractor card. Then we got my 50th anniversary parallel, and then we got the OPG International foil, the OPG International Chrome, the OPG International Chrome Refractor, and then the Bowman 50th Anniversary Refractor out of five. What a beautiful card, just almost impossible to find. And this one, as you can see, stamped out of five, five of five. So there you go. That completed my rainbow. Thank you so much, Kevin, for uh, helping me out. Getting this card to me and getting this rainbow done. I just can't thank you enough, man. Um, but yeah, that's, that's what I got for you today. This is a pretty monumental day for me just because I got this rainbow done. Now on to number 164. Get a few more of those in and uh, get that one done. But anyway, hope you guys had a good night. Take care of yourselves.